Hey guys, ViscosComb24 here, bringing you a real quick redstone video to showcase my compacted 10x10 double cave door. So you can see it all closes, and when I go on over to the back side, it looks the exact same as the front. And if I go back on over to the front here and flick the lever again, you can see that it also opens, although the opening does take a little while longer than the closing. Um, but I am pretty happy with how fast I was able to get this. So, um, like most of the doors in this world, um, this is full flush on both sides. Um, as you can see here, yep, full flush on both sides. And I was really, really trying to keep this thing compact. So it only has a volume of 7,956 blocks. It is 18 blocks wide, 26 blocks tall, so the height is... Oh, yeah, it's pretty big. And it is 17 blocks deep. So, again, volume of 7,956. I'm pretty happy with it. Um, you can probably see a lot of similarities um, between this one and the 9x9. But this um, required a, a little bit of um, changing. Um, obviously, it's you know, different door frame size, and um, the top wiring is most mostly all from scratch, and I'm, you know, just overall pretty happy with the outcome. Um, something that I should tell you guys about this world is that um, I'm planning on making a world download for it, so I've mostly cleared it out except for that thing, um, but this, I will soon be making a world download for it once I have done compacted cave doors for every size through to like, I think I'm going to stop at 12 by 12. 12 by 12 is just about the um, biggest I can make with the compacted layouts that I have planned. But yeah, hope you all enjoy this really, really quick showcase. Um, I will be doing Labcraft soon, hopefully. And uh, yeah, that's just about it for this video. I'm ViscoseComb24 and I'll see you next time. So yeah, again, hope you all enjoyed. I will be making up to 12 by 12 in that world and making it all compact. I don't know about 13 by 13 and above, because in order to make that, I would need to have a really, really small six piston extender for the sides. But if I can find a way to make a small six piston extender, I will be using it for compacted 13 by 13 and 14 by 14 cave doors. But I'll see you all next time. Bye.